Hello and welcome to video one of two for today and in today's videos I'm going to be showcasing some coins that I've recently got in. Those of you who saw the mass unboxing of about 800 plus coins I'm going to be showing off the German Deutschmarks. So both the 10s and the 5s. I did have a request from Glenn from Gerwardy's Coins and Bank Notes who he's like, put the 5 up. I was like, yes, I will be doing that. So if any of you haven't checked out his channel, please do. I'll put the link in my subs subscription? Description. I'll put it in my description. Uh, I really like his channel because it reminds me of when I was a kid, to be honest. He's got such a variety of coins and banknotes that it does bring me back to my younger years. So, in today's video, I will be going through the 10 and the 5 Deutschmarks. So, I've got three of these in. So, this is the Olympic Stadium. So, 1972, as you can see. I think this is a shell. I think this is a stadium. Olympisch Spieler München. Now, my German is not amazing. I actually lived in Germany for a while and I had a German girlfriend for five years, which sadly didn't work out. But my German is terrible. So, Bundesrepublik Deutschland, Deutschmark. I think the Bundesrepublik is Banks Republic, I think. Germany, Deutschmark. It's an okay coin. I, I'm not sold on it. It's a clever idea, but I'm not really sold on that. So I've got three of these in. Oh, by the way, they've all got, they're not readed in edge. These are all silver, by the way. I think they stopped making the silver Deutschmarks in 1975, unless they were commemorative. And also one last thing is they've all got, they've all got different eagles on the back. That's a cool eagle, with that being further up. So again, different eagle. I've only got four of the, the ten. Different eagle. Different eagle. I think part of it, and please correct me if I'm wrong, is the eagle depends on who minted it, which state. Uh, Germany is a country that's split into states like America. And they've all got their own practices and ways of doing things. So let's see what this one says. This is really difficult to read. In Deutschland, Spieler der Olympiade. Again, this is another Olympic coin. Bundesrepublik Deutschland. I think this is Frankfurt Mint. No, ah, no, I am wrong about the Eagles. This is a different Mint. G, I don't know what G is. And J. I know Stuttgart has a mint. Um, I, that's where I lived. Okay, let's look at these ones. See where these are minted. J, G, F. Yep, I got two of these in. F, D. I've just realized all the, the 10 Deutschmarks are Olympic coins, so it's probably a specialist thing minted. Munchen. So 20th Olympics, 1972 in Munich. For those of you who are listening, uh, if there's anyone who's German, I'm actually, I want to do a PhD in Germany in 2019. So I am kind of looking for someone who wants to, wants to talk German with someone. I really like the different different eagles. So yep, this is the the tens, ten Deutschmarks. Now onto the fives. So this is the one that Glenn asked me to do. I have a load of these.
these are pretty boring. I think they're the standard design. I've got three of these. I've got a lot of, of individual ones actually. He just gave me a bulk when I bought them. I like this coin. This coin's nice. Balthazar. Neumann. I'm presuming that Balthazar Neumann is some sort of the church. 1687, 70, 53. It would make sense. Nice eagle. Nice design. I actually went to the tallest cathedral in Europe. Actually, it might be the world. I'm, I'm not too sure. It's in Ulm. And it makes your neck hurt a lot. Again, it's got a description. Ridzain Heiligen. That's right. Welfard Skersha Ridzain Heiligen. I don't know what that says, to be honest. So, I know my German is very limited. I can order plane tickets and stuff like that, but I will never be... Well, I don't say I'll never be fluent. I, I think it, I'm a long way from being fluent. Euro Pisces. Think now should I Certain words really get me. Uh, some words just roll off the tongue and other words I look and I think, nope. Love this eagle. Absolutely love this eagle. Very nice. So yeah, I've got two of these. I'm guessing this is something to do with, with Europe. Right. I'm not too sure. I've got two of these in. I didn't know you could have so many variations of an eagle. Fair play, <laughs> you know. My favorite coin's coming up soon, I'll, I'll show you. I don't know what this this green stuff is. I've seen it on coins before, but I, I don't actually know what it is. This one's a bit nasty. It's that one. Albrecht Jura. I'm assuming that these coins represent people well, I'll leave my favourite one to last actually so this one's simple so this is 150 years of the German Archaeological Institute we come up to 200 years about 10 years so it's Deutsches Archaeologisch Institute. My ex was, uh, she spoke uh, Swabian. So for those of you who don't know what Swabian is, it, it's, it's a sub-language in Baden-Württemberg. Actually, she was very talented. She, she spoke six languages. So she spoke, I think it was French, Spanish, German, English, Swabian, and Swedish. So I met her when I lived in Sweden. She picked up Swedish in about three months, like the whole, the whole lot. I couldn't believe it. That's a nice eagle. So these are all silver coins, by the way. Second to last. Albert Schweitzer. And last but not least, this is my favorite one. Bauer de Fichsterner, Niklaus 
Copernicus, Copernicus, Nicholas Copernicus. Those of you who don't know it, so Saturn, Jupiter, Mars, Earth, Venus, Mercury, Sun. I, growing up, I loved anything to do with planets. But this is really neat in the style of a globe. That, that's really, really neat. I loved anything to do with planets growing up. Uh, I was a proper nerd on planets. And then I realised I sucked at physics and the chances of me ever being a scientist were uh, <laughs> slim and none, you know. <laughs> it wasn't going to happen. So, yeah, tell me what you think of my... Uh, I'm not going to say collection, because as everyone knows, I buy and sell. I'm, I might keep this one, I'm undecided. But tell me what you think. Like, subscribe, do your thing. Let me know. Take care, guys. Bye.